John, a bit like Saturday, that must be quite hard to take tonight. Yes, very difficult to accept that we've actually lost that game. Uh, we've dominated it for long, long periods in the game. But we haven't got our rewards from it, which we deserved. Penalty shot at the end. <laughs> what were your thoughts? Well, it's without doubt. You look at players' reactions. And when you've got like eight red shirts that run around the referee, just fully expecting him to give a penalty. Uh, the fact that him and the linesman uh, didn't give it. Um, but that's the decision they make. We have to accept it, even if it was the wrong one. Um, but uh, it was a handball on the line. Uh, I could see from where I sat, and I'm a good 60 yards away. Uh, everybody else in the ground saw it. The whole of their bench saw it as well. Couldn't believe he hadn't given it. It's a red card and a penalty to us, and the game changes. But uh, it wasn't given, so um, we have to get on with it. 2-0 down after 48 minutes. Mm. We could have easily have folded, I suppose, but the boys no, show tremendous. No, they don't do that, no, do they? They no. show tremendous resolve. Got back in the game, <clears> and then, like we said, really took the match to Norwich in the closing stages. Well, we just well, I'd say the closing stages. The last half an hour, we were just camped in their penalty box. Um, we did have a lot of chances. Uh, maybe should have made some better decisions when we were in possession in their box. Um, once or twice, people maybe should have passed it to other people when uh, when they were trying to score. But uh, that happens. Um, but an incredible uh, attitude from my boys. Um, but it doesn't change the result. You know, I can stand here uh, saying many things and try and justify um, why we didn't win the match. But um, ultimately, it's, it's about the result. We're not in the hat tomorrow, which I, uh, on the performance that we had, we should be. But we're not. So. Um, I have to accept it. I'm a bit getting a bit fed up of dominating matches and not winning them. So uh, we need to uh, <coughs> be a little bit tighter at the back. We've made a couple of errors tonight, which is unlike us. Um, obviously, Brian for the first one. I think, in fact, the shot was possibly going wide. But he's kept us in the game many, many weeks, uh, many matches. Brian's been outstanding for us. Um, and uh, he slipped up tonight, uh, which is totally against the kind of character that he is and the type of goalkeeper he is. So, uh, but he's still in credit. So uh, he's hurting, as everybody else is. But we'll pick ourselves up. We've got a big match to play on Saturday back in the league. I was going to say, if, you, if we can keep producing these performances, then we are going to get a bit of luck. Things are going to run for us, and we are going to get the results. Well, I'd like to think so. But um, you know, I, I can hear myself repeating. Repeating myself from last season sometimes, you know, when we dominated games and not got the results that we deserve from the match, and uh, it's all about sort of scoring goals. Um, you know, we, we've got to score more goals. We haven't got to, as I was fourth goal of the season. Other people have got to contribute. Um, but there's a lot, lots of good things from the match, and as always in a situation like this, I'll, I'll concentrate on the good things with the players, and um, you know, they're picking up really good habits. And the way that we kept the ball in the second half was um, was, was very very good. Uh, when you come to a place like this, you know all the half of their team have played in the championship. I know they brought up uh, brought out a few tonight. A couple of new signings they've got. I think the number ten for Norwich is his salary is probably the whole of our squad. Uh, what what the whole of our squad earns in one week, he earns in one week on his own. So that kind of shows you the. Uh, kind of situation that we're up against but um, we'll battle on Finally a word for the fans tonight John <laughs> excellent all night weren't they superb Brilliant but obviously we give them something to shout about in the way that uh, the way that the team played um, I don't think there'll be too many of them that will go away from here tonight as bitterly disappointed as myself uh, they do take it to heart as well but um, I think that the way that they responded at the final whistle to the players performance tonight would suggest that uh, you know, they saw a team out there that worked very hard wearing the Crawley Town shirt and, um, and our fortunes will change.